Good morning. Well, it's afternoon, but. This green one, this new one, elderflower and caruba. Oh, this tastes good. If you know me, you know I love kettle corn. So I seen this girl on TikTok. She, these are the little sticky things. I have it on my clear case, but I got a new phone case. So I'm going to stick both of these together. And that way I can put it on and take it off my phone case as I please. Because y'all, this sticks to everything like sticks to everything like got it off tiktok shop but it gets annoying sometimes and then i just bought some hair dye because i had dyed my hair like purple it was like magenta or whatever um And then I bought this got to be two in one brow and edge gel. So yeah, we're about to dye my hair because having dyed hair is cute, but the maintenance is I don't I don't want to have to redye it. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, and I didn't wanna do it. I'm over it. It was cute while I had it. I'm done. I'm just tired of my hair looking like this. I'm tired of looking like I don't care about myself. And then, I don't know, I've been noticing like when I look for other people's channels, um, It's like not coming up. I don't know what YouTube got going on right now, but I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it at all. Like, when I go, I really need to do my eyebrows too, but I'm trying to let them grow out because I've been thinning them out. Um. Like, if I try to watch somebody's video on my TV, it works. I, I can see everybody's channel, everything. But when I try to watch it on my phone, it's like, now half the videos are gone. Can't see anything. It's only displaying shorts. I don't want to watch nobody's YouTube short. Like, no shade, no tea, but like, no. I, no. 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 But it's 3.27 right now. I start work at 6.30. We're finna dye my hair. We're finna dye my hair because I'm so tired of looking like this. 
so tired. And then my baby hairs be like blonde, so then it don't even look like I did my baby hairs. This is the Clairol. I've used different brands every time I dye my hair. Oh, not them giving two sets of gloves. Okay. This was like the first day I got to really sleep in. As y'all know, I work two jobs, six to seven days a week. Um, tomorrow is my off day, but I'm trying to decide if I want to braid my hair or mini twist it. So that's why we're dying it today. So if I wake up tomorrow and decide that's what I'm going to do, that's what we're going to do. It's hot in Florida. I'm ready to get the ASAP because it's too hot. I don't want no straight hair. I did want to do like um this quick weave I had did a while ago. But I just what the fuck is on here? But I just don't, I don't want to have to maintain, like, straight hair. And then at work, we have, like, two patios, so I don't really want to have to, um, I don't, you never know what section you're going to be in at work, and I don't want to have to have my hair looking like, who did it and why? So, if y'all see me looking down, the cat is in here. So, I'm just trying to make sure he not in nothing. He don't got no business in here. So, I just put the color into the developer. And we just going to shake this up and apply it. Luckily, I don't have to like dye all of my hair. I'm just doing the front and the back section. <clears throat> like, what is this? Where did you even get this from? So. And then I just hate that I don't be making content. Like, I really have been just, what's the word? 
I've been just overthinking like the type of videos I want to put out. Even though it's the kind of videos I watch. I've just been overthinking it. And it's really nothing to overthink because it's not even that deep. I mean, like, I'm a deep thinker and stuff. Like, I definitely am an intellectual person. But, like, it's just not, it's not that deep for me to be overthinking it. Is all I'm saying. The type of videos and the content and what I want to talk about and stuff.
feel like myself again. Okay, so it came out just how I wanted it. It's just black, so yeah. <sighs> but we're gonna use the rest of this TGIN buttercream because there's not much of anything left in here. Um, so there's that. That way I can just. Um, and braid my hair tomorrow. Um, but yeah. I keep saying I'm going to stop dyeing my hair. And I just. I'm going to stop at one point. But just stuff needs to stop happening to me. <laughs> that makes me want to dye my hair. So. I knew it was going to rain. I just knew it was gonna rain. Cause it looked like it was gonna rain outside. <clears throat> so much for thinking I was gonna go to the pool. So yeah, I'm just using this. I really like this buttercream. Um because I don't have a lot. I'm gonna try to spread it out as much as possible throughout all of my hair. I have no clue the cat was in here, so. But yeah, um, I talked to y'all yesterday and I kind of, I didn't, I don't know. Let me just get my thoughts together. Anyway, um, I'm going to do like a moving series. I probably should talk more about me moving, but. I'm like, how do I say this? Like, I'm still processing the fact that I am moving again. And I feel like I'm still processing the fact that I actually lived in Florida. Like, even though I actively live here, like, I'm always like, oh my gosh, like, I actually live in Florida. Like, that's crazy. Um,. Nobody in my family has ever moved out of state besides my great-great-grandmother when she first moved to California. Um, and no family member has moved since. <laughs> so, my great-grandmother is originally was born in Mississippi, raised in Louisiana. And she moved to California when she was like 14 or like 16. And my whole family has been there since nobody's ever left besides me um i did think that i would like be the family member that like moved out of state and like stayed but i think i just haven't found like somewhere that i thoroughly enjoy um 
that kind of checks all those boxes that aren't racist that aren't you know taxes aren't absolutely insane jumping off the freaking walls um and then you know i can live in a nice community i definitely want to be around more black people um one of my friends actually told me like the dmv area he thinks i would really like which i've also thought as well but I was, i've also never been and i've also never been to tampa before i moved here so that's another situation in itself um But I'm very, like, free-spirited, so, like, I don't necessarily mind moving places I've never been to. Um, but I've been to Florida before, I just never visited Tampa before I moved here, so. I always tell people I've never been here before, so every day is a new day for me because I've never been here. So, like, the worst thing somebody can ask me is what I want to do because I've never been here. So, <laughs> I'm always going to pick the places that I've gone before. And then I'm also, like, a routines type of person, so it's, like... yeah <laughs> i am very much sticking to my routine this is all gone so <sighs> i'm going to i bought this honey hydrate and i haven't used it since the first time that i bought it because it just gave like oily like maybe with the mini twist it would work but like i was not feeling like feeling feeling how i was and then I'm just doing this very like sloppy or messy because I'm gonna put it in a bun and go to work. So I enjoy Miami, but Miami just reminds me of LA and I Miami is like a weekend type of thing, but not even like a weekend, like a couple of days during the week. <laughs> type of thing. Not even like a weekend thing, because it just be too many people there, be too much going on and that's not the vibe so that's also why i moved to tampa i don't think i ever really talked about this before um because i needed something a little more chill a little bit more relaxed compared to miami but i i have enjoyed my experience in florida oh and then let me just tell y'all how um i was at work yesterday and my table was a black lady and like her aunt and I think like her sister, like something, it was like a black family though, but like it was all ladies at the table. So she sits down first and she's like, oh, I'm waiting on, you know, my, my people or whatever. Like um, I'm visiting from out of town. I was like, oh, okay. Um, And I'm like, you know where are you from she's like i'm from san diego i'm like oh i'm from san francisco she's like oh you my grandbaby now and i said she said baby what you doing here and i said i said oh i said oh um auntie i'm gonna go home <laughs> don't even worry about it i'm going home she said yes yeah, sweetheart you need to get up out of here this is not the place for us this is not the place and i don't know if she meant the place like for us as in black people or us as in like people that's from california um, but I really didn't have a lot of time to talk to her, so there's that. Um, but she was so sweet, and she was like, she said, baby, I will take you home with me when I leave tomorrow, okay? She said, so you need, you need to go back home. I said, okay, I'm going. I said, I'm going. My time is very much so coming to an end. But, yeah. So, I'm about to put my hair in a bun because I'm going to work and I'm not doing nothing after work. So, I'll catch on a little bit. That's pretty much, y'all, my days be all over the place. But I just, all I try to do is go to the gym, eat better, and go to work. Um, and then most of y'all know, like, I don't really have any friends or family here outside of my coworkers, so that's really why I don't be doing stuff 
here um and i've never really talked about like tampa or like where i live or anything because just for like privacy reasons i didn't want anybody like stalking me or trying to figure out where i was at tampa's pretty small to me so just for like my own safety precautions because like i watched a couple youtubers and they've done like living alone in miami or living in miami single living blah, 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 here and it's like there's a lot of people on youtube <laughs> Um, and there's a lot of people in the world. And the last thing that I want is somebody find me just strictly based off of, like, my YouTube channel. And, and try to do some weird shit. Not going for it, babe. So, yeah. Thank y'all so much for watching. This video is literally about to go up right now. Um, and I'm just going to post the videos I want to post. I'm going to treat YouTube as Instagram and TikTok. TikTok is like my number one platform. I absolutely love TikTok, but I just find myself scrolling too much and I don't like that. And I want to completely get out of it. So I'm just going to post my content on here. So as always, you're beautiful just as you are. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see y'all in the next video.